Hi, Falcons. Thank you for tuning in on this special segment on school lunches. Why did four and four skip lunch? Because they already <laughs> ate. <laughs> we are your hosts, Hannah. And Jordan. And today we will be discussing some controversial topics on school lunches. We've asked some of you your opinions on whether you think it's healthy, wasted, and diverse. These are some of your responses. Yes. No. Strawberry milk, oh my god. Ah, that's true, we should have some chocolate. I had it in middle school when I went to Orchard Park, that was fire. Yeah, strawberry milk looks pretty good. Oh my god. Thank you, Falcons, for your opinion. We decided to take this investigative journalism to the next level. We asked our lunch lady, Lisa, for some insights. Here we have several different positions um, and different hours. First, the people that come in in the morning do the main courses. They, they do all our spicy chickens, which we have every day. And then they usually do peanut butter jellies, turkey delis. That's all done every day. Then we have specials where it might be cheeseburger and fries. So that person's a, a, a longer day. She's here earlier in the morning. She supplies all the special lunches. Then what we do, we have somebody that prepares all the fruit, somebody that um, prepares like tacos or other entrees that we may be having. And then we also have to do our cleanup. So as we're going, we have people that do dishes and then we separate food and warmers. So we have warmers and we have cold units. So we always prepare enough food for the whole day but we split the food in half so that nobody's getting more or less you know for first lunch and second lunch so i know a lot of times kids come up and they're like ah oh, you're out of pizza or you know oh you're out of burritos well it, it is it is even we do make enough for the first lunch and we make enough for the last lunch unfortunately it's not all pizza so if you want pizza or you want the spicy chicken you want to come in sooner in your hands is really important every time we come in from touching or doing something we wash our hands when we leave we have to have sanitizer buckets we wash them we put our sanitizer buckets aside when we go to start lunch we grab a clean towel we'll grab our sanitizer buckets we come back wash them for stations and then start serving our you know our lunches to the kids the district gives I'm sure my manager you know the what we sh we should be doing and then of course health and safety so we have to have so many calories you know they have to be made you have to have your fruits you have to have your uh, vegetable you have to have your milk and you have to have your protein so what the manager does is she comes up with the menu and then that menu is what we use 
Yeah, no, definitely. We would wish that we could have more options. We used to do the salads, which was a really big hit, and the kids loved the salads, but right now, because of the way the economy and things are, we're not always getting the fresh vegetables that we would like to get. Thank you for tuning in on this special segment. We are your host, Hannah. And Jordan. Stay swaggy, Falcons. <laughs> I am P.A. You are P.A. Period.